so the other day on while I was on Twitter and I think I post something about my uh, sciatic nerve pain thing and uh, either that I don't remember what I posted but Bipo company contact me and not really contact me I guess it was a small little conversation and uh, and they suggest that I try their product and I said okay so they asked me for my address and I sent it to them and then they sent me the package and in the package there are three uh, three flavors actually one is uh, what is that chocolate obviously and this one is uh, vanilla what's the other one trying to see where they write the, the thing that we should be free which one is that okay so chocolate I'm assuming this is vanilla yeah vanilla French vanilla and this one is instant red protein supplement or natural okay I don't know what flavor is this but anyway I'm gonna try the French vanilla I just came from the gym I did legs today so uh, I didn't really go, this is my second leg workout for, uh, for this week, so I didn't really go heavy. So um, anyway, I'm doing a little post-workout meal, and uh, I decided let me record it and uh, see how their product tastes. So alright, as usual, um, I like to put uh, yogurt. So I'm going to put yogurt. Usually people like the unsweetened ones, but I like my stuff to have some sort of a taste. So I'm putting, I think this is 4 ounce of uh, yogurt. And then um, this is the water I'm gonna put. The package suggested that I use uh, between six to eight ounce of cold water or skim milk. I like to use, when I do my shakes, I like to put water. So I'm putting eight ounce, exactly eight ounce. So let me just, you know what? Let's get all the little thing out. ounce of water and I'm just gonna put these are some foods that I have in the fridge I had them for a while I hope they still so I'm gonna put a little bit of uh, strawberry and I think I have some uh, what is that uh, mango peach so I don't want to put too much where it become too thick so that's about it of the, uh, let me put one more, of the uh, foot, and I'm going to put the, uh, the protein, so again I'm going to try the French vanilla. So I'm going to use all of the thing, just let me sort of smell it and see how it Smell good. So there it is. Hopefully I don't spill it. So I'm gonna stir it a little bit so it doesn't stick. I should have put it a little bit after. Because if I put the cover in, it's gonna stick to the thing and it won't blend very well. Okay. Here's the cover. Let's cover it up and see what happens. Normally I put, I like to put a little bit of egg white in it, but I think I'm going to fry some eggs 
eat with some rice and some other stuff. So let's see how that goes. French vanilla. Um, it tastes, it's not bad. I'm not saying it's bad. It just tastes a bit different from the kind that I usually use. I like it. Once again, thank you. And um, it's a good taste. I did put the exact amount that you guys suggested. Maybe I should have. I guess the only thing I should. I will say. Instead of the 8 ounce, maybe I should try 7 or 6.5 ounce. I think I, 8 ounce is a bit too much water for the packet. That's my only thing. It, uh, it tastes a little bit. Uh, I will say watered down because of the amount of water that I put but um, I still taste the, the things that I put in it so once again thank you and next time that when I use the other two I'll try to use seven ounce and I'll see if I should uh, if I should uh, just use the minimum required which was six ounce so the next one will be, se I'll do 7 ounce, and then the last one I'll do, uh, I guess, 6 ounce and see if there's any difference. But um, besides that, it's okay. It's good. Actually, after drinking, I think I'm full. I'm not going to make the eggs anymore. I'm already full from that. I'm not going to make the eggs. So maybe in another two or three hours, I'll make the eggs and eat with rice and some vegetables. All right, thanks. Bye, product. Bye, poor. Not bye, product. Bye, poor. And um, I'll finish drink this while I do some work in the computer. Today, today is March sixteenth. It's been about, I'll say maybe two to three weeks probably three weeks since i first test the uh the protein and since then i've been kind of sick i was sick for like two weeks but i've been going to the gym but my taste bud has been a little bit out of whack uh so i then did the other test of the other uh bipo products and i wanted to put all of them in one video <clears throat> the first one that I did, I remember, I haven't looked at the video, I put, I think this thing requires, yeah, 8 ounce um, for one of these pouch. This pouch is 0.78. And uh, based on what I remember, I think I felt like uh, the 8 ounce was a bit too much for this packet, for 0.8 ounce. And I remember telling myself, next time that I try it again, I'm going to put 7 ounces of water, which is what I did here. 7 ounces of water. And uh, <clears throat> I'll see if it's, you know, a little bit different. And if the 7 um, ounce feels a little bit uh, watered down still, the last one I will try 6 ounces, and then that will be it because they only sent me three, 3 samples. Um, but the taste was good. It, I just felt like it was a bit too, uh, bland or watered down. I think that's the word that I used. So I put the seven ounce. This is the second try. The second sample. I put, uh, what was it? Seven ounce of water. And I'm going to add a little bit cinnamon. I always do that when I'm doing my, uh, not that much. Just a little pinch of cinnamon. 
and I have some fruits uh, that I've I have in the freezer quite a while I need to use them now it's springtime so we're gonna have a lot of uh, you know fruits and stuff available I'm gonna put a couple fruits this is raspberry I'm not really measuring anything I'm just putting a couple the rest here and I have some other ones <clears throat> this has different kind of things in there I have mangoes uh, strawberries peach so it's really nothing in particular so I think that's enough for that and I'm gonna put one egg Usually I like to eat after I work out, unless if I'm going somewhere, then I'll, it's better to do that uh, shake really quick. But I like to eat after I work out, keeps me full a little bit longer, but, so I'm just going to add one egg. I don't remember if I did that on the first one. Either I put egg white, okay. That's that, and I'm gonna put, let me open this. So I'm using, which flavor is that? Isolate supplement, all natural, da, 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 da. where's the flavor? Original. Where did I see the flavor at? This look like, uh, how do you call this? Um, vanilla or something like that it's the white one I don't, the first one I think it was a different vanilla flavor but anyway let me blend it slightly so it doesn't get stuck and the thing I'm putting all of it nothing is staying Okay, there it is. Okay. We shall see how that tastes. So seven ounce of water this time, not eight. That is good. Let's see. There it is. Seven ounce of water this time. missing here something maybe I'm so used with the other uh, proteins that I usually get where they have a little bit of sugar taste in it but this one doesn't have any sugar okay let me where's the thing it did say sugar free zero carb fat free sugar free yeah I think that's what I'm uh, that was my problem because I'm so used with the other ones that I guess they have added sugar in it. So I'm missing that sweetness in it. Maybe that's what it is. But otherwise, the label did say sugar free. I just remember that. So I guess that's why I felt like uh, it was missing something. It's the sugar that it's missing. But otherwise, it's perfect. I think 7 ounce is better than the 8 ounce. So the next one that I'm going to do, I'm going to maintain that seven ounce instead of the instead of the eight ounce it requires um but it is good uh if you're looking for sweetness in it it doesn't have it that was my problem with the first uh test yeah it, it's perfect 
yeah if you're looking for a sweetness this one doesn't have it i completely forgot the part about there it is it says sugar free there's no sugar in it so the first one that i try i was like oh it's missing something duh, 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 duh. duh it's missing the sugar so i'm so used with all the other proteins i don't wanna i have a couple of them here i don't wanna interrupt this sample um by putting mention the name but um that's the thing it's the sugar that i think i was missing because all the other ones usually have sugar so there's that sweetness that i'm always looking for so this one doesn't have it but it is perfect it's good if you're looking for sweetness this one does not have it and the label did say it so that's my thought on the first uh sample and also i think the uh the seven ounce is better than the eight ounce it feels more um rich it's not watered down and this and with the seven ounce so there you have it yeah the seven ounce that's my only thing based on the recommendation the packet requires <clears throat> suggested mix one packet of bipolar with eight ounce of cold water skim or whatever liquid you I guess you want um, and then consume one or more serving daily so yeah I think seven ounce is better than the eight ounce that's my only thing and besides that I like it it feels much rich more uh, how I say that what's the word okay if I find the word when I'm editing it I'll put it at the bottom but it feels more uh, condensed that's the word condensed um, than the uh, eight ounce the eight ounce feels too much watery but this one I I'm tasting everything that I put in it so yeah thanks bye Paul and my next time I'm going the next time I'm going to the gym is on Friday I'm resting tomorrow so hopefully I'll test the, the last one and then I'll see if I taste the same way that I'm tasting this sample right now. Okay, today is March 18, Friday, March 18. That small little number right underneath this, March 18th. Focus, focus. Anyway, it's March 18. Uh, I'm doing my last sample for BIPO. And I should have that on, online, maybe, hopefully over the weekend. I'll edit it. Just came from the gym. And I'm still out of breath. My heart rate is still going. I'm waiting until it gets to 90 for me to stop it. Um... I'm doing my last sample. Last time that uh, I did the sample, from what I remember, I used seven ounce instead of the eight ounce of water that uh, the package recommended. Because the very first one, uh, when I, I followed the uh, the suggested use, they suggested eight ounce. Uh, or uh, with six to eight ounce. Okay, now I'm saying six to eight ounce so i found out the seven ounce was much better um so there's the seven ounce of water i don't know if you guys can see it but and i'm gonna add one egg one whole egg i'm really hungry and i'm gonna put some raspberries these are leftovers uh, raspberry that I had. No, but not too much. I put the crumbs. Save these for next time. And I have some other fruits in here. I'm gonna put a little bit of peach and um, strawberry. Just one strawberry. And 
I had these for a while. Oh, I have some papaya, so I'll put papaya instead. Okay, there's little pieces of peach. I don't want it to be too thick. So that's it. With the foot. So I'm trying to use almost the same thing that I did last time. So I could see the result. Um, the, you know, the taste. So that's that. And I'm going to put the protein powder. This time is the chocolate. The whole pocket I'm going to use. I don't usually like uh, chocolate as my... Uh, I love chocolate for like uh, uh, candy, candy balls or something like that. But not for like protein uh, powder. I like just plain vanilla. But I'm going to try to pass that uh, bias. Not to affect the taste. Okay, so now I'm just going to add the 7 ounce of water. It seems like the other packages, I should have saved them. The other package said 8 ounce. I, I don't remember seeing, unless if, I don't remember seeing the last two packages saying 6 to 8 ounce of water. Maybe it did say it and I, I didn't say it, but the 8 ounce is too much for me. It's too watered down. The 7 ounce seems perfect for me last time, so I'm I'm maintaining that same um, amount. My son has a half a day. He's going to come out of school soon, so I have to hurry up. I'm doing this so the protein doesn't get stuck. To mention again I know all three uh, all three of the taste tests is gonna be on one video but um, the very first video my I completely forgot that the things said is sugar free so there's absolutely no sugar no sweetness in this so that sort of probably influence how I felt originally so the second time when I did it which was on Wednesday, I believe. That's Monday. Yeah, on Wednesday. That's when I went to the gym. On Wednesday, I was sugar-free. So, I just want to mention that. Um, because all the other uh, protein powders that I've used have some sort of sweetness in it. So, this one doesn't have it. So, I don't want to... Uh, minimize the taste of the bipolar product in comparison to the ones that have sugar because my taste bud is used with the sugar, the sweetness. So without the sugar, the, uh, it's really good. It's perfect. So I think the seven ounce of water is the perfect um, measurement, the amount of water for me that I, I should put if I when I use that small package. But otherwise, everything is good. I like it. So once again, thanks Bipo for sending me the sample and I will definitely buy it. I think there's one store, they don't have it at GNC. Um, I'll try that store that they just opened, that uh, nutrition store near my house. But anyway, thanks again. This is my first product review. I hope my explanation makes sense and I enjoyed uh, tasting it. Thanks again for sending me the samples. Thanks, bye for.